The accident that took the lives of 31-year-old David McNay and his wife Ella happened New Year's Eve 2015. They weren't doing anything wrong. They went out that night to go get dinner. They were, and then David posted on his social media, he said, who are you going to be kissing at midnight? Because I know who I will be. They never got to celebrate the New Year together because a drunk driver crossed the center line and hit them head on. When the phone rang that night, I'm like, oh, you're a little early because of course he was calling me to tell me Happy New Year. Um, you know, I didn't get that call. Mark Huffman was in court this morning to find out his punishment. According to police, he was driving drunk at more than twice the legal limit and had painkillers in his system. He pleaded guilty to two counts of murder. These charges were not dropped or reduced. Um, the only reason that we agreed to the 20 year sentence is because this defendant's already in his 60s and that 20 year sentence is in all likelihood a life sentence for him. Huffman's attorney read a statement from him saying he has no memory of the night but wanted to step up and take responsibility. No sentence will return what was lost. They were two funny kids. They laughed all the time. They they just laughed. I mean, their laughter is what I miss the most. Enjoyed life. Yeah, they just they were they were just in love. Huffman's already been in custody for nearly a thousand days. He's not eligible for parole until he has served a total of 17 years, putting him well into his 70s by that time. From the Kenton County Courthouse, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.